Relax. You got this. Hey everybody, welcome to Boots and Jeans Rider. This is Rich. Okay. Cake back there behind the cameras. It's kind of a windy day, so hopefully I don't have to yell. All I'm here to say is relax. You got this. You may be doing this when you're practicing your U-turns. You got everything right. You got your eyes, your head, your friction zone, a little pressure on the back brake, but you can't get those U-turns down consistently. You may be doing something unconsciously that you didn't realize. I'm going to show you what I'm talking about when I say relax. So let's talk about relax for a minute. The word relax just means serenity. You know, you come from a hard day of work, you go home, you relax. Everything's become good. You're out there riding on a motorcycle trip all day. You get home, you're all stressed up, probably because you wasn't relaxed riding that bike. So we're going to show you how that relates to motorcycle parking lot practice doing slow maneuvers, relax. You may not be completing those U-turns consistently. You got them, but every time you go back, you gotta do it four times before you hit that U-turn again after a week of rest. So we're gonna show you what you may be doing unconsciously. And what I'm talking about is not relaxing that left arm when you're making those U-turns. I'm talking about the left arm because here in the United States, we make all our U-turns to the left. Obviously in a parking lot, you make left, right, and maneuvers also. So I'm going to show you on two different bikes how to relax because the fraction of a second, a fraction of a second that you lean your bike, the handlebar is going to turn automatically in slow parking lot maneuvers. So all you got to do is relax and control the handlebars. So here's the first bike. I am going to demonstrate what I mean about relaxing on the, with your handlebars. So for this demonstration, my left arm is going to be the stiff arm that a lot of people are doing unconsciously and not realizing it. So as you're in your parking lot practice and you're going along nice and slow and you want to make that U-turn, you got everything down, you're in a friction zone, you're using the rear brake, you're in the right gear, you're leaning the bike, you're whipping your head and eyes around to where you want to go, but your U-turn is wide your demonstration this fist gonna represent your turn I'm going straight I'm going straight I lean the bike the minute I lean this bike you can see the handlebar gonna turn but because my arms so stiff I'm making a wide turn when I should be making a sharp turn so I'm gonna show you one more time I'm gonna show you one more time with my hand not touching the handlebar just to show you if you're almost relaxed how sharp your turn can be. So I'm going down, I'm doing everything I'm supposed to do, and I'm riding, riding, riding. I make that, I lean the bike just a little bit without touching it. Look how sharp the bike turns. Just that easy. So in essence, if you just relax that left arm, even if you have to jab it into your side, you can make these turns consistently. Now I'm not talking about somebody who's just learning. I'm talking about somebody who got it and wasn't sure and not making it consistently. I'm going to get on the big boy right there, that bike over there, and show you how to do it, exactly what I just done. Now I'm on the bike, and let me tilt the camera down a little bit more, I hope that didn't catch it. Cake's over there with the other camera. So what I'm going to do is demonstrate the same thing. Now, I do believe that you must control the handlebars. And by no means am I advocating that you take your hands off the handlebars while doing this. I'm just illustrating how, when you relax, it can be done. Now remember, I'm taking my left hand off. So once your left hand comes off, you are no longer in a friction zone. And all you have to do is just throttle a little bit more to keep a steady throttle and put a little bit more pressure on the rear brake if you decide to do this with your hands off. But the minute I take my hand off the handlebar, the right the, the wheel is going to turn. So I'm going to do it, demonstrate it right quick. And Kate's going to catch it. So let me turn around, looking where I want to go. Okay, I'm rolling. I'm doing everything that I was taught. And so now when I try to make 
that U-turn, if I'm stiff, I'm trying to make the U-turn inside of where cake is, I'm stiff, and then I realize, uh-oh, I need to turn it a little bit more. And by then, I done overshot my U-turn. So I'm gonna do it one more time and show you that it can be done when you just relax. Like I'm making a U-turn now, my left arm is totally relaxed. To show you it's totally relaxed, I'm gonna do it up here again. I'm in second gear, making my hand is off, lean, the bike is turning. I can feel, I can actually feel the handlebar turning on its own. And all I need to do from here on in is control it straight up, lean, it's turning. I'm not pushing with my right hand. All I'm doing is leaning the bike because technically my arm is relaxed and I am controlling where I'm going. Last time, now, what I'm going to do now is actually do the U-turn again with the relax. Now you can jam that in the side if you want to. But so now I'm in the friction zone, head and eyes relax, let it turn, and all I got to do is control the handlebar to if I want it at full lock or not. And that completes this demonstration. But remember, I'm not advocating that you take your hand off the handlebar. Because if you do, you are no longer in the friction zone and you really need to have great throttle control and a little pressure on that rear brake. But if you do, as soon as you take your hand off it, the second you lean that bike, you'll feel it pulling your right arm. So relax. You got this. From Boots and Jeans Riders, I'm Rich. Cake behind the camera. If you are riding today, remember, ride long, ride hard, ride strong, and most importantly, ride safe. Relax. You got this. And we out. Peace. My turn. I'm going to demonstrate it on his bike. Yes, you got for your you. Damn <laughs>